I know what you're thinking. It looks like a Chinese or Oriental restaurant. But it is not. That is simply to get attention, guys. And this place right here, I keep asking all my taxi drivers, what are some of the best spots for tacos in town? And they keep telling me, you gotta go to this place right here. Tacos Orientales de Cuernavaca, Los Auténticos. So we're gonna go and check it out. It looks like it's about to rain. So let's go inside here and, and find some delicious food, I hope. Okay, check that out. <laughs> the pictures are selling me. Woo! This cheese, guys. I'm hoping that it's the local Menonita cheese because it is excellent. Buenas tardes. Hola, buenas tardes. Buena, mesa para dos. Nos sentamos donde sea. Donde gusten, en la mesa los atienden. Okay, muchas gracias. Buenas tardes. Buenas tardes. Ok, eh, una preguntita, estoy curioso. Sí. Eh, ¿Los dueños de aquí son orientales o, o no? No, son mexicanos. Mexicanos. Sí. Ok, entonces solo es 100% comida mexicana acá. Sí, me, me, ok, está bien. Pues que algo que me recomiendas aquí en especial, lo que más ordena a la gente. Pues son los taquitos al pastor. Tenemos tacos de chuleta. Tacos de chuleta. Pues todos están buenos, ¿verdad? Pero por ejemplo, el pastor, está la gabacha, viene de, de, de es también pastor, pero con queso. Uy, con queso. ¿Y ¿Ese es el queso de Chihuahua, el menonitas? Pues el queso tipo laurel, sí, es tipo... de aquí de Chihuahua. Ok, un, un queso local entonces que sí, usan. Sí, así es. Cebollitas, limón y esta salsita, salsita de queso. Pues una es con tomate y chile de árbol y morita. Esta ¿Cuál? es con esta naranja. Esta. Okay. Y, y la verde es con jalapeño y, y chile, digo, y tomatillo. Ok, eso son picosas. Pues más o menos, no tan picosas, pero sí. Ah, bueno, vamos a ver, a mí me encanta. Y luego tenemos esta roja, esa sí es chile morita de árbol y, y tomatillo, pero ese es con agua y estas están con aceite. Ok. Buenas tardes, caballero. ¿Qué vamos a preparar primero? Vamos a preparar la media chuleta y los medios vegetarianos. Okay. Le ponemos un poquito morrón y poquito cebolla. Okay. Un poquito champiñón. Un poquito sazonador. Magui. I don't have to tell you, it's smelling really good here. Un 
¿Listo? Sí, este es el pastor. For me, it's already enough this portion. And look at that, we have like, I never seen that that mini cute tortillas. <laughs> it's like the smallest we ever seen here in Mexico. So cute. I'm gonna do cute mini tacos with that. Tacos al pastor, baby. So we're gonna go ahead and try these out over here. I'm gonna try one out first plain by itself. And then I'm gonna try with these little sauces that they gave me over here. Yo. <laughs> Surprise me there. Alrighty guys, let's go for it. Mmm. It's good. That's good. The pineapple is very sweet. And they put a very big chunk on there. Now I'm gonna go straight for their sauce. Cause I am dying to put a little bit more flavor in there. I didn't get a huge kick. So we're gonna go with this one first. Let's make sure we get a lot of it there. All right. Mmm. Oh man. What can I say? It tastes like Chipotle a little bit, but it's not. It's a little bit different, but very, very similar to Chipotle. Now next up, I'm gonna put some of this. Oh, and it's hot. I feel a little bit, it's a little bit hot. I'm gonna try this sauce here. I'm gonna add some lime juice. And some onions there. And we're gonna get a nice bite. Look at this little cute monster. Put a little more. Not a huge game changer, so I'm gonna take this one for the win. But we have this sauce as well. Let's try that one. One sauce per taco. Pretty much. These little mini baby tacos. <laughs> more watery but it's better for my in my personal opinion and it's hotter too caliente all right i'm getting one of this mini cute tortilla it smells like corn for sure so what do we have here i have some avocado some cheese some onion champion uh, mushroom champignon <laughs> just so easy for me to say champignones and cebolla tomato i mean i have just all vegetarian with some cheese added on the top Let's see if I can get a bit of everything. I'll get this avocado right here with a little bit of cheese. It's a new cheese for you to try. Oh yeah, I never tried this one. Look, I'm gonna put a lot of cheese. I need to be able to close it though because otherwise... But yeah, look, it's so cute. <laughs> Woo! Mmm! Mm. Really like the combination of all the veggies. This is good too. Mm. And I love the mini portion. I don't like eating a lot like Carlos, so I love having just a small bite. Like, mm. it's cute and easy to eat. Alrighty, guys, so I decided to order some of this cheese because when I was in the kitchen, I noticed that I never tried it, so I wanted to go in. So I got the 
queso fundido platter. They reheated my chuleta. Exactamente. They reheated my chuleta, and now we're gonna go. We're gonna go in and give this a go. I'm gonna get my little plate here again. Uh, we're gonna go. I prefer tortillas de maíz. But I'm gonna get one of these little. <laughs> I don't know what, oh, they, they remind me of the little tortillas. If you ever had a Lunchable back in the States, these little like almost plastic food you get as a kid in school, they have something like this, like mini tortilla versions of it. It reminds me of that, but this is the real deal here. Now, let's just load this baby up. Gonna add some meat, oof, nice and hot. And I'm gonna try this taco just like that to get the, the flavor of this meat here. That was juicy. Very good, this meat, very well seasoned. Nice and juicy. Now I can't wait for the next taco because it's gonna have the cheese. It's gonna have all the vitamins here. Mm. Delicious. I'm gonna suck on that bone after. Have a look, guys. The cheese looks wonderful. <laughs> it looks delicious. Have a look at this. Imagine this little tortilla with this big old bone over here. Man, you know what? I cannot wait. Oh, good lord. <laughs> so flavorful, fatty, greasy, juicy, all that good stuff. Mmm. Oh, man. Time to, time to make a real taco, guys. A little bit of meat. I guess it just goes as far as you want it to go. Whoop. Bam. No seeds. Bam, let's try this like that. And after, I'll add the rest of the vitamins. This cheese is simply delicious. I think Chihuahua has some of the best cheese I've had in Mexico so far. It is just, man, they know how to do their cheese. Let's just say that. I just wanted to put a little bit of cheese, but I might've put a bit too much. Not really. Now, I wanna try something wild and I'm gonna add all three sauces to this. That's why. And especially this bad boy right here. Ooh, ooh. A little bit of juice. Some cebollitas. Sauce is dripping there. All right, this ought to be a delicious taco. One bite. <laughs> That's why. Mm. Explosion mm. in the mouth. I'm translating. It's mm. a mixture of an explosion in the mouth. Mm. All the flavor all together mm. goes directly to my heart. Mm. Love it. Mm. <laughs> I speak the sign language. <laughs> Mmm. Mmm. Mm. I mean, like a quesadilla just burrito out of my veggie tacos. Delicious. Bigger version after the mini one. Mmm. Big version. What do you think about the cheese? Really good. Really greasy. Pretty tasty. Yeah, guys. Um, I didn't order the cheese in the beginning. And after I had my food here on the table, it, I just felt something was missing. So I ordered this cheese and I think the cheese is a mega game changer. It is like, it's like putting in a cheat code and you know, you just get superpowers and it cranks things up. That's how I feel about this cheese and what it's done 
to this meal as a whole. It just complements the whole situation very well. Especially if, if you like cheese on your tacos like I do. Alright guys, there's a total. The total is $268. So that is $10, $13 USD for everything we had. And I didn't mention, but we had a Jamaican water, aka hibiscus water. I haven't seen weather like this since oh, it's dark. I haven't seen weather like that since I left Miami, guys. That you see gray on one side and then you see some blue on the other. Anyways, I'm gonna wrap up this video. The food was delicious. Especially what you come here for is the tacos de chuleta. That is what you come here for. The al pastores were, I'll leave it like that. But the chuleta, wow, delicious with the cheese. I don't have anything else to say, guys. Um, anything to say? No, I liked it too. Like really nice to have a vegetarian option already ready on the menu for me. <laughs> and the little mini tortillas. They were like one bite-sized little things. It was cool to change it up. And yeah, I don't have anything else to say, guys. Hasta la vista from Chihuahua.